Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Narita Wahida and I will talk about the importance of the blue wheel. So first of all, wheel and mud. Wheel and environment. When it comes to the environment and the ocean ecosystem, will help to regulate the flow of the food by helping a stable food chain and ensuring that certain animals or species do not overpopulate the ocean. For example, Ecolocation, aquatic environment, marine life or biology, and marine mammal intelligence, and other important oceanic topics. So, thank you. See, this problem is not caused by predators, but human hand itself destroys the unique creatures. Poaching, climate change, pollution, oil spills, boat pollution, and bycatch are all man-made issues that are pushing our marine wildlife to the brink of extinction. Overfishing by some, overfishing by someone who is irresponsible and not aware about his environment put the marine life at risk. The most common issue is plastic usage, usage that can threaten marine life throughout the ocean as you can see in the video. According to IUCN, at least 8 million tons of plastic end up in our ocean every year and make up 80% of all marine debris from surface water to deep sea sediment. Marine species ingest or uh, entangled by plastic debris which, which causes severe injuries and death. The use of nets and traps also uh, threaten the marine organism. Such techniques to catch fish end up killing them. Thank you. 
other smaller marine mammal species are even more likely to be underestimated and as they are less likely to be noticed by mariners and the animals are likely to be covered, recovered on a beach. Second, how can we help to protect marine animals from vessel strikes? Hit all regulation and guidelines regarding, regarding staff operation of vessels around mar marine animals. If a whale or turtle in the vicinity of your vessel, travel at a slow, safe speed and leave the area if possible. Here are some tips, tips to avoid collision. The first one, keep a sharp lookout. Look for blows, dorsal fins, flukes and others. The second one, watch your speed. In areas of known whale of turtle appearance, keeping speeds to 10 knots or, or less can reduce potential for injury. The third one, keep your distance. If you see a whale or turtle, stay at least 100 yards away. The fourth one, slow your boat immediately and put it in neutral. If you see a whale or turtle, resume at a slow pace, safe speed and distance your vessel from the wind. from areas important to their survival. Increasing evidence suggests that exposure to in intense underwater sound in some settings may cause some whales to strain and ultimately die. NOAA Fisheries is investigating all aspects of acoustic communication and hearing in marine animals, as well as the effect of sound on whale behavior and hearing. Fisheries issued technical guidance for assessing the effect of 